America. I'm Luke Moyer. That's weird. <laughs> uh, so say, yeah, America, I'm Luke Moyer. I'm in the Navy. Hey, America. I'm Luke Moyer. And oh. there we go. And I'm a photographer in and out of the Navy. All right, welcome to Chicago, the Windy City. So a lot of people don't know, uh, you know Chicago's called the Windy City. They think it's because of the wind. It's not. It's actually because of this ship right here, the Windy. Uh, it is very windy in the middle of winter, so I'm pretty pumped to be outside right now. But uh, seriously though, I love just going out to the city, taking photos. Right now we're gonna be going to uh, what's called the Bean, which is uh, a Chicago landmark that's pretty much a giant stainless steel bean. So it's gonna be great, all right. It's cold, real cold. Everyone else took my hand warmers, so. So today we're in Libertyville because uh, yesterday we were in Chicago and it was a little bit uh, too cold. Uh, the way it works in Illinois is the weather bumps about 20 degrees every day, so you never know what you're gonna get. So yeah, we're just gonna go around the street today and see if we can find some cool stuff. It used to be a lot scarier when I would go home and upload my photos to edit. Um, back when I was first starting out, you would take say 100 photos, you'd be happy if five came out. When I go somewhere and I experience something, if it's a place where I can take photos and kind of document it, uh, I will. Uh, actually, I have a pretty bad memory with a lot of things, so I kind of like having the, uh, the visual uh, history of the places I've been. I've always been interested in photography uh, and art in general. You know, I always used to love to draw and, and uh, I never really had a camera until I was in high school. I took a photography course and I was able to actually get my hands on a camera and use it. And then I always kind of planned on joining the military uh, just to pay for college and kind of get a jump start on my life. I didn't want to have the debt that my brother and sister had going straight into college. And then uh, I was originally going to join the Air Force, but they never called back. So I uh, went to the Navy. I went to the Navy website, and I was kind of looking for photography jobs, and ended up finding uh, mass communication specialist, which is exactly what I was looking for. All right, thanks for hanging out with me in Libertyville. Uh, we're gonna try to go to Chicago again tomorrow. It's supposed to be a little bit warmer than the last time. So, uh, whoa, uh, I gotta run pick up my wife. Don't worry, I made it in time. All right, we're back in Chicago, and uh, it's a little warmer out today, which is good, so. Let's go see if we can find some cool stuff. Uh, so every city is kind of different in terms of uh, photography and kind of the feel of it, uh, especially uh, I grew up in Las Vegas, which everyone sees as like casinos and the strip and everything, but once you get outside of the main downtown area, uh, it's just a bunch of suburbs and, and small buildings and stuff. So being in a city like Chicago where, you know, for miles and miles, there's all these skyscrapers and huge buildings, it's really a, really a different environment to try to take photos of, and it's really a different kind of feel that you want to capture. So. Some of my favorite photos, which was a hard question for me, because they kind of change constantly, but um, Fourth of July in Hawaii on deployment, um, we just went to the beach to see the fireworks, and I kind of built a little sand 
uh, pile and set my camera up on it and took uh, some pictures and I ended up getting this really cool um, firework going off, really cool colors and then this guy with his hair blown back, looks like the fireworks like crazy explosive and awesome and uh, this one is one from when uh, Vice President uh, Joe Biden came and visited uh, my ship. I got to follow him around uh, for the day and kind of be his uh, photographer for the day, which is really cool. And uh, this is when he was talking to everyone on our ship. And I just kind of yeah. dropped the camera on the ground and hoped that it would kind of make a cool photo. And uh, it ended up being really cool with the lights they had set up for him and then everyone watching him. And uh, he's just kind of cool lit. He's got like an outline light. Uh, it's one of my favorite photos. It's just compositionally really cool. Alright, so this is a Cloud Gate, or as a lot of people refer to in Chicago as the Bean. Uh, it's a really famous Chicago landmark. Uh, I just came here to get some cool photos. Like, I really wanted a photo that didn't have any people in it. And so the way I had to do that is I, I pretty much uh, take a bunch of photos. I, I think I took 60 photos of it uh, over amount of time, so I'll be able to take it into Photoshop and kind of layer all those photos together. I actually, get a shot of uh, the statue or the uh, the cloud gate without any people in it. So, I'm hoping it works out. Well, guys, thanks for having a day with Luke. Uh, you probably didn't feel the cold as much as I did, but, you know, I hope you all had a good time. I'm just glad that the military gave me the opportunity to be a photographer at work and a photographer in my personal life. See you guys later. Other than me.